Hey YouTube, you have Leonard here. Green guys and gals, Boku no Koko no Yabayatsu. We're here, we're alive. Season 2, The Dangers in My Heart. Episode number 11, everybody. So, once again, we're hopping right into this episode. I am excited for the usual. Uh, give me one second. Of course, everyone, you can follow me on Twitch. Link the search box down below to all my live reactions coming through. We have a good time over on the Twitch side. Truly, truly do. Now, one thing we're going to do quickly. I'm just checking. Oh, we're so close to a nine. I'm just looking at my anime list because, again, I was of the hope, the way things are climbing. This this series might, could we get to a nine? It's so close. We're at an 8.81. Rank number 31 on my anime list. Oh, this series is amazing. I typically don't care about my anime list, but not bad. Are we getting Day Day Live confirmed April 10th? I cannot wait. I was going to be so hype. I was so hype. But anyway, everybody, without further ado, we're going to hop right into this episode. Last week was great. I know what's going to happen this episode, which tells me, I think, in the next two, we're going to get the peak of peaks. I can't wait. Without further ado, let's begin this one. Smash that like button, everyone. It is greatly appreciated as always. And with that, we're going to begin. Get the timer up. Is this timer working? Yes, it is. We're going to start in 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. The Sports Festival! That was very exact. I can't. This teacher is too much for me. They are indeed adapting the sports festival. I'm shocked. Which means that the sports festival is going to literally be one episode. <laughs> eh? He's like, what? He's like, what are you talking about? Each guy's like, yo, get me out of this, man. I don't want anything to do with this whole thing. Ah, can't wait. We're going to do sports festival is going to be one episode, I'm assuming, this episode. And then we're going to start the next arc. And just so I remember again, this is 13 episodes. That means we're going to get two episodes then for the final arc of this season. Oh my gosh, I don't want this to end. You guys don't understand how much I love this series. Speaking of, so let's get back to the manga. Behind the manga. One sec. <sighs> All right, here we go. Let us begin. One night, because you're too small to be like a coward. Mm, he's like, mm. he's like, who are you? She's like, you don't know my guy. Don't talk about each guy like that. What is wrong with him? Adachi, what is wrong with you, man? Hey, man. Soul leveling has been amazing. But Danger's My Heart is just different. Danger's My Heart hits different, man. It's just the best. Oh! 
Oh, yeah. The memories. Oh no. He dipped. I guess soul leveling has been amazing, by the way. It's just different level. <laughs> Back when he hated her, when he wanted her dead. <laughs> I forgot how bad Ichikawa was. I forgot how bad he was. Yeah, please. Please. <laughs> I love this one. Oh, he got messed up pretty bad. Interesting. Huh? Man, you scarred him. You got his bones broken. I'm kidding. I'm kidding, by the way. I'm kidding. Adachi. Huh? How does he know? He knows now. He knows. It's so interesting because as trash as Adachi is, the two of them have developed a genuine friendship. It's like, fr they're not even frenemies. They are friends, but it's like, you also respect his feelings. That's what Ichikawa is doing this. Ichikawa loves Yamada, and the idea of him, in a sense, losing this would be like him losing in terms of his love for Yamada to... I hate to say it's again the trash that is Adachi. He doesn't want Adachi's his friend and he doesn't want to lose to Adachi. He knows that Yamada likes him, does not care about Adachi whatsoever, but still. You still don't like him? I don't like him either. I really dislike Adachi's character. They can be friends, I can still dislike him. Game over. Your life is done. Talking to yourself in front of Yamada. And Yamada's cra- Oh my, wait. Yamada's talking to the dog. <laughs> Dead. Wait, I just realized that. She was over here talking to her dog. And, oh my gosh. He's like, why are you talking in dog? Ichika, I don't want to get exposed. Yamada proceeds to expose herself. She's like, huh? You don't want to lose because of me. Interesting. Aww. I love how they hold hands. I truly do. Yo, each call is dying. <laughs> oh my gosh. Again? A quickie? What does this mean? Oh. <laughs> I don't know. What is that supposed to be? I'm kidding. I, I know that is. I'm kidding. I'm trolling so hard.
Can we not do this angle? <laughs> I can't. I can't do this. Oh. I love this show so much. There we go. Look at him. A bigger one? Where is her dad? I guess that'd work. Dang, she just came for his life. <laughs> mm-hmm. He was very serious. So like I said before, he knows how Adachi feels about Yamada. He's aware that Adachi's aware of his feelings, and how she feels for him. That's why he cannot reject it. It's like a direct challenge. He, he can't reject him. That's your friend. So even more so, he really doesn't want to reject him. And he doesn't want to lose. Ah. Oh. Yeah. Dead. Now he likes you. He loves you. On the sweet stuff. What is... Oh, uh, yeah. And I love how, like, Festival Girl, whatever you call her, is just, like, watching intently. Flash mob. Aw. Is she writing on his bang? Was she writing on his bangs? Or under his bangs? Wait, what does she write? I'm so curious. I don't know what she wrote. Adachi? Oh, Adachi. Did he fake the echo? <laughs> Did he really fake the echo? With all our members. Ando-san. Dang, James, that hurts. <laughs> oh, my gosh. And, of course, you know what Yamada's going to do. You just outed yourselves. Zetem! I love you. Did she get disqualified?
That's so funny. Oh, wait a second. It was... <laughs> Aside from Yamada, this is crazy. Adachi, get out of here. Adachi, please get out of here. Wait, so she faked the paper? She faked it? She's so stupid, man. Let the battle begin. I love these flashbacks. Why is this giving me Naruto versus Sasuke Valley of the End vibes? He was like, no one actually thought about that. <laughs> Look at Chicago. I'm so ready. Yamada's ready. This is so cool. I think you're kind of doing it for both, but you're mainly doing it for your love. It's literally just because you don't want to lose. For Yamada. Oh. 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 He earnestly really loves Ichikawa. Exactly. Exactly. Mm. Nothing but facts. I feel so bad. This is amazing. And the headbutt. I love this. Oh, I'm loving this so much. Sukina! And they can't hear any of this? Oh, and they can't hear any of this. What the? Oh, he jumped. Kyo. Ichika. He's like, yeah. I don't want to lose. He lost. And she wrote his name. T 
Dang. Why was this so hype and it's such a... Oh. The Sasuke bandana scene. That was amazing. Second air? Yep. Bro, that's his sister. It's <laughs> so stupid. I hate him. Yo, get lost, kid. Moriko definitely deserves better. And I love when she walks away. I love it. No, we cannot ship Moriko and Adachi. She, does, she can do so much better. Please, don't ship that. But I feel so bad. Disappointment. I'm so proud of Ichikawa. Honestly, despite what Adachi's nonsense was just now. Oh, Yo, she made so much. That's a rice balls. She made a lot. Oh my. That's too much for him. That's way too much for him. I do remember when I read this and I said that. Sister pulled up, I was like, this man can never be redeemed. I do remember that. Kill. Was she saying that you were really cool, Kill? Or you were really cool today? These are the questions. Play on words. I digress. Oh my gosh. Guys, they made... The, how they make this so good? I remember when I read this in the manga, for those who are anime onlys, it was really intense and it was cool. But man, they took this to the next level. It was the voice acting. The voice acting was so on point with all of this. That's the thing. And it's like you really felt for... Like, they, they made me, as again, someone who does not like Adachi. I really legitimately felt so bad for Adachi here. I was just like, dang, man. Just let him have some happiness. Like, when he's just like, at the end of the day, he's just like, I just want to go out in shame. And for Kyotaro, because that's, again, it's... Don't disrespect the rivalry. And it's like, you're my friend. Like, don't go out like this. Oh, that was so cool. And it's actually kind of nice that Adachi in the end won. It was actually kind of nice that he won. It is important because we get to see what's underneath the headband. At the end of the day, it was his name. And to see, like, Yamda's genuine concern calling out to him and running after Oh, my gosh. But even, like, the headbutt. And, yeah, next week, we're not, we're not, no, the next episode or two, we're not going to be ready. We will not be ready. You guys have no idea. Alright, that's the episode. We're done here. We're done here. We are not ready for next week. Next week is the episode. Where are we at? 8.81? This better go to like an 8.9 or a 9. I'm telling you right now. I completely agree. Oh my gosh. Absolutely amazing. So again, for me... A, episode 11, 11 out of 10 episode. This was really good. And I, I, I can't stress enough. With every episode to see Ichikawa. 
he's out. It's just amazing because it went from him having to acknowledge to himself that he likes Yamada to wanting to tell her to know he's saying this out loud. Now, we know that no one could hear because of the rain for the most part, except for anyone who was like there. But like he said it out loud for Adachi to hear. And he did that. He likes Yamada. Like he won't let him win because Yamada is the girl that he likes. It's really amazing. It truly is. So I love this episode. I can't wait for next week's episode. Oh, it's gonna be peak. The telling you right now, if I have not made this very clear, and I think I've said this before, the dangers in my heart. Season two, Danger Heart overall is amazing. Season two is the best anime of this entire season. And that's easy for me. And this is going to be, as far as I'm concerned, the anime of the year. I'm not sure if I'm going to see anything else this year that will top us. And this is a season two. If you put the whole thing in totality, forget about it. But like, this is a second core. And this second core is going to be is, is better than I'm pretty sure anything that I will see this year. I feel very confident about that. It's amazing. If they skip the opening because this is John. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know, James. They could do it all in one. I don't know. I think it's going to be the... I, I don't know. I, I want to, I can't talk about it, obviously, but yeah. Hey, Gerald, welcome to the stream. Are you a little late? Yeah. Episode's done. Episode's done. Ten, 11 out of 10 episodes, by the way. Hey, again, for those who are coming in on Twitch right now, I mean, this is just amazing. This episode was amazing. They took the manga content, which was a 10, and they took, well, like a 9, and they took it to an 11. Hey, Leewick, long time to see what's up, what is good. Welcome to the stream. Oh my gosh, what an amazing episode. It, it, it perfectly adapted. So for those on the YouTube side, again, let me know your thoughts. Did you enjoy what was a very odd Adachi versus Ichikawa episode? It was also odd because Adachi chases after everybody. And for him to like Yamada, it, it feels weird and superficial for the same reason that Kyotaro said. Because, like, he doesn't really know Yamada. And we know that Ishikawa knows Yamada. We know Yamada from what we've seen. So, it, it kind of makes Adachi's love feel kind of, like, shallow. But, again, that's just how it is. And when you think about it for boys, or even girls for that matter, um, when you first get to learn about someone, like, it's the superficial stuff. So, it's not to downplay Adachi's feelings, but Adachi, like... He goes from one person to the next to the next. But I do believe, again, he was sincere and that he does like Yamada. I, mean, I don't think he was as sincere as Pickup Senpai, though. Pickup Senpai legitimately liked Yamada. Not great, but he did. Adachi went for each... By the way, that's super weird, by the way. How do you go for your... You don't know her, by the way, so it's just purely... How do you go for your... I'll call him your best friend. How do you go for your best friend's big sister? Come on, man. Come on. No, it's true, though. Pick up Senpai's feelings for Yamada, while we don't like Pick up Senpai, was definitely stronger than Adachi's feelings. He had legitimate reasons for liking Yamada. He was just kind of trash and didn't know how to express himself. Not that great. They didn't respect her boundaries. I mean, Pick up Senpai was trash. He was. But he's not that bad. I mean, Adachi's worse, honestly. Well, uh, Adachi's like innocent trash. If that makes sense. Like, Adachi's harmless. But he's so gross. Pick up Senpai has the potential to be dangerous. Because he got a little bit... I don't know. Most consistent side character in this series has always been Moiko. I agree. Moiko's great. And Moiko's also useful because she's a clear... How do I explain this? She's like... Se not Senpai, sorry. She's Ishikawa's first friend, essentially, in the series. If you exclude Yamada. Moiko was the first person to ever be in his corner, have his back, do stuff for him. Like, Moiko really was his first friend. If you think about it deeply enough. It's kind of cool. Oh, my gosh. Let me peek with the... Yeah, I can't wait. I can't wait for next week. Anyway, everyone, let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below once again. Like the video, like the video, subscribe for my content is greatly appreciated as always. And with that, I'm Len and I am out. Take care, everybody. Of course, have a good one. Peace.